Hey everybody, I'm just doing a quick voiceover here because unfortunately this audio was damaged and it wasn't salvageable in post. So I'm just letting you know that this is the only campsite that is in this loop. It is very wet and rainy, which is characteristic of uh, Washington State where I'm at in this video. I'm also letting you know in this portion that I do plan on hiking the perimeter, which is two miles, and showing you all of the sites that are in this specific location. I'm also letting you know that I have a classic camp meal to cook up. I have some good local beers to drink. We're going to lay back and enjoy nature. But before I do any of that, I got to take a little nip off of the old banana flask. <laughs> Still working my way through that bottle of Howler Head. It's a uh, banana flavored whiskey bourbon type of deal. Oh, all right, let's get camp set up. This seems to be the good spot right here. I'm gonna string a tarp through here. I'm gonna do the uh, tent underneath that. Yeah, that'll do it. On my tent fix. I didn't have to do all that curving. No big deal. I've got to get my uh, campfire going and cook up my camp meal. This rain keeps coming and going. I don't know if it's going to hold. I don't know if it's going to get heavy. I don't know exactly what's going to happen. Um, but yeah, let's take a walk around and let me show you the sights. I'm 
not sure if I'm going to be able to show you guys around tonight because I'm losing light. I'll try to see if we can squeeze in a little tour of the whole trail tomorrow. this one piece back to camp here and there's no way we're going to need more than this. We're going to be set for the night. Woo! Oh yeah. I broke the tripod knocking it over as I was walking past with an armful of wood. Luckily I do have a spare. The spare is basically like a selfie stick that has a tripod on the end of it. So it's not great, um, but it'll definitely get us through in a pinch. You gotta work with what you got. Life happens sometimes. Woo, okay. Let's get that fire going. That was about the hardest time I've ever had starting a fire. <laughs> oh, you can see it's pitch black dark now. Um, it took me well over an hour to get that going. I wasn't even sure if I wanted to stick around if I wasn't gonna be able to get it going, but I am pretty sure we are rocking and rolling. So I'm gonna dump some more bigger pieces on top of this and just keep the sucker rolling because I do not want to have to go through that again. Woo. Hello. Hello. This is where an axe would come in handy or a hatchet. Okay. Whew. Pretty happy with that. Woo. Okay. I know some people complained about uh, the flip-flops in a previous video. Some people are weird about seeing your feet, I guess, but um you're gonna have to deal with it I, i'm 
uh, getting like a good pair of camp shoes, like some Crocs or something, it's, it's definitely on the list. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to remember to do that soon. Whew, I think that calls for a celebration. Rain is super, super light too. Um, but yeah, my boots are just soaked through. So at least now they're getting some air. My feetsies. Cheers. Man, look at that smoke coming off of me. My rain's definitely coming back in. No question about that. That water is like crystal clear. I'm not going to filter it, I don't think, because I don't think there's a lot of sediment in there. I just need to kill bacteria and stuff. So I'm just going to give it a nice long boil. And um, then I'm going to use it to make my camp dinner. Ooh. That rain seems to come and go. It's a bit heavy at the moment. I'm gonna give it a minute and uh, see if uh, see if it chills out. Uh, I've been getting rained on for like four or five days straight. I'm just gonna relax under the tarp for a little bit. is much needed yes sir mm. super easy super simple this used to be like a go-to but haven't had it in quite some time mm. basic mac and cheese is just so good so easy Look at the steam coming off of my clothes. Soaked to the bone. Ooh. Well, I'd say that's a uh, day well done. Um, I'm gonna enjoy this fire. I gotta go hang my food bag still. I am uh, in bear territory. And um, yeah, I'm gonna hit the hay. Anything crazy happens, I'll definitely film it. Otherwise, Check back with you in the morning. Good night, everybody. Morning, everybody. It's actually a great sleep in the tent. Um, I just heard the rain popping off the tent a little bit and the and the tarp above, and it was just a great um, it was a great sleep. Very peaceful. Whew. Well, yeah, it's time to get up and at them. Okay, so 
If you haven't been watching the last couple of videos or if you're new to the channel, then you may not know that I'm on like a five day camping trip and I've driven to three different locations and this is my third camp. Um, but ever since the first day, <laughs> my feet have been wet. My boots got wet. The, I haven't been able to dry them out. Um, that's what happens when you camp in nonstop rain, basically. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know when I'm going to be back here to make more videos. So hopefully I'll be back, you know, soon. But um, uh, I definitely want to show you guys what's up and i told you guys i'd take you around the loop and see the sights and that's what we're gonna do so come on let's do it most of the time when you're looking out on the trail it's very pretty but when you look towards the lake it looks like this so you can't really see those mountains and, and you can't see the lake and stuff but it'll kind of poke out on you sometimes and then you'll get views like this. Ooh. It's a big tree. <laughs> Over on this side, we're actually doing switchbacks and uh, getting a little bit of elevation going this way. I'm on the opposite side of the lake than where I camped right now.
accidentally uh, left my knife a little too close to the fire last night. So if you're wondering how far that uh, tang goes down, definitely take that with us. All right, everybody. Oh, this has been a wonderful camp. I'm heading out of here now. Um, going to pick up Mrs. Bananas from the airport. We uh, got a whole week long uh, vacation um, that we're gonna do. We're gonna have a little travel vlog for that over on Patreon if you're interested. I know everybody can't do it and or doesn't want to and, and that's totally fine too. Um, that's what these uh, three videos that I made for you guys are all about, so. Um, yeah, at any rate, uh, I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Genuinely, I mean that. Every one of you who watched the video makes it possible that I can do this for a living. And uh, that is uh, something that's really special to me. It means a lot. If you liked the video and you like what you saw, I would appreciate it if you would click that banana. And we're going to catch you on the next one, everybody. Bye now.